Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So if you are someone who is preparing for CSINET exam and because now exam is so near, you are thinking and you are feeling that whatever you have studied, you are forgetting everything or you are getting anxious about the exam, you are getting demotivated for the exam and the feeling, the negative feeling about the exam is like overpowering you, then probably this is the video where I'm going to talk about all these things in detail. All right. So this is called exam anxiety and this happens with everyone okay so first of all let me tell you that if you are feeling so uh, like if you are feeling uh, and having such feelings inside you then probably you are on the right track and probably you are taking this exam seriously so plus one for you okay for this particular thing so you should be happy at least for that that yes you are taking this exam seriously and that's why you are getting all this feeling and believe me anyone who prepares for any exam okay Remember when you were giving your board exams, remember when you were giving any other exam, in all the cases, this is how human behavior is or human uh, like psychology works. When you are close to the exam, you feel more anxious about it. You start finding out more scenarios related to it and that's where the anxiety comes in and that's where your those negative thoughts, they, started com they start coming in your mind and that's where you start feeling that you don't know anything, you are forgetting everything, okay? So there is nothing wrong in it and everybody feels like that. So first of all, you have to accept it that if you are feeling in that way, then probably your friends and the one who is going to get All India Rank 1, that person is also going to, is also feeling the same, okay? So that means on this particular ground, everybody is equal. You are no behind someone, okay? So that is one feeling which you have to accept and you have to understand yourself, okay? So the question is that how to get out, get over this, okay? How you can like overcome this? The first thing, as I said, that you have to accept it, okay? You have to accept that, yes, these feelings are there and this is a common thing. This is a common nervousness. This is a common anxiety, which everybody deals with and you can also deal with it, okay? So that is the first point which you have to take care of. You have to make yourself understand that it's nothing unusual which is happening with you. Everyone who is preparing for this exam is actually feeling in the quite in the similar way. The second thing which you have to do now is you don't have to, uh, you know, hover around your strategies. Whatever you are doing till now, you don't have to jump off from there. Don't start thinking that, okay, uh, since I am forgetting things, so let's, uh, let's not solve questions now. Let's get back and let's study. Let's try to understand the concepts and let's try to memorize things. Let's try to memorize the formula. That is just going to consume more of the time of yours, okay? So as I have discussed in my previous video, uh, where I have discussed about one month strategy in case if you have not watched please watch that video so there I have discussed it that now is the time when you have to solve questions okay so that is something which you cannot miss and you should actually do that okay so try to solve questions don't uh, change your strategy just because of these anxiety and just because of these feeling okay so stick to the strategy whatever strategy you have made I'm not compelling you to follow a particular strategy whatever strategy you have made for the remaining days of the exam just stick to that okay the third thing is that you have to be consistent i have already discussed about this in my previous video because this feeling like this feeling of anxiety this feeling of nervousness this sometimes overpowers your uh, like your uh, you know your preparation things and then you start feeling lazy about your preparation you start feeling that if i'm not remembering or it probably i am not going to make it this time don't let these negative things or these negative thoughts overpower you okay so just keep doing whatever you were doing. Be consistent. Just try to, you know, be mindful and just sit over there and try to give your time to the, your studies. If you're not having, if you're not able to concentrate in that, then try to meditate. Okay. Meditation might help you to build up a focus on your preparation. And then the next very important thing is that you just don't have to over pressurize yourself. Okay. It's just exam. So don't over pressurize yourself that this is going to be do or die kind of situation. Don't let that thing happen to you because the more you will pressurize yourself, the more it is going to affect your preparation. It is more going to, it is going to make things worse. Okay. You might have seen in cricket, a batsman who comes in under pressure, it is very difficult for him to perform, but a batsman who comes without taking any pressure and the one who comes just to enjoy the game, that person generally plays well okay so this thing applies for exams as well you don't have to over pressurize yourself you don't have to uh, like you don't have to over pressurize your thoughts you just have to do your best that's all okay just think of that you can just do your best you are nowhere to 
sit and prove yourself you are not going to prove each and everything uh, like in the exam you are just going there to see the questions you are just going to solve those questions which you know and that's it okay and having said that you also have to take out some time and uh, you know relax your mind because if you will just sit and just read and just study for the remaining days it will be too much pressure for you i would suggest you to relax a little bit whatever thing gives you peace okay a bit uh, you know playing some game or you know chit chatting with friends or uh, whatever whatever thing gives you peace try to do that uh, try to do that at least once or twice a day and uh, that is very important okay and one more very important thing is that when you are discussing with your friend this thing is my personal experience okay i'm just adding it over here because i have seen it and i have experienced it so when you talk to your friends about or when you are in that relaxation mode right when you are talking to your friends don't talk about exam over there because then you will start discussing about questions then you will start discussing about how much you have prepared how much i have prepared and then any one of you is going to have that anxiety because you might think that okay the other person has prepared more than me or the other person has studied more topics than me so don't let that happen okay if you are talking to your friend don't discuss about exam try to avoid these discussions just to relax your mind okay don't, don't so that you don't over pressurize yourself and yeah, again as i said that you should not discuss about your how much you have studied these things are like very childish but still like we used to do that's how like we prepare for exam and i know i have also prepared and during that time like my friends and we used to discuss like that but i will recommend you not to do that because this will only give you more anxiety and more nervousness for the exam so i would not say that all these if you follow all these points uh, you might not feel uh, nervous or you might not feel anxious see as i said this is how human mind works that's how our psychology works so you will definitely feel nervous you will definitely feel anxious because you are preparing for certain thing but if you follow these things probably it might relax you a little bit it might help you a little bit to uh, so that these nervousness this anxiety is not going to overpower your thoughts okay so just let that feeling be there let the nervousness let the anxiety be there but let don't let that overpower your strategy overpower your preparation overpower your exam and overpower you okay so that's all for this video i just wanted to make a short video discussing about uh, these exam like final days of exam and i am with you guys and i know how it feels during these days so if you have any other question you can ask me in the comment section below that's all from my side for this particular video uh, i'll see you guys in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care